I think this is where you really start to uh, break out when when things go challenging. You know, it's it's great to have bright people. It's great to have circumstances working your way, uh, getting the right kind of breaks and all of that. But I'm sure there must have been some challenges, some fears, certain things you would have really looked at squarely uh, in life before you went on a path of your own calling. So, so. do you do you recollect some of those or are they very vividly in front of you can you share some of those instances with us so for me um uh, there was a phase in my life uh, which where i started having a lot of self doubt and I, where i started having a lot of questions about myself um this was in 2005 uh you know when i had just come out of my uh, my pr business and um uh, i i had shut it down it was a running business and i shut it down for an opportunity that came my way which didn't go the way i wanted it to go unfortunately and uh i was going through a really bad phase in my career in my life uh, at that point of time to the extent that i was i was going through a depression and uh, i was cut off completely from the world and uh, i was at home for about 3 full full months uh, not talking to anybody not focusing on what i wanted to really do and i was just sulking about the fact that why did i even think about closing my business and and thinking about doing something new which didn't go my way uh and that's when i got a lot of support from my family especially my father who came and came in and spoke to me once and he said you know there's nothing for you to lose you've just gained another experience you've started a business in the past i think you can start it again nothing stops you from doing that and he just told me one thing i mean just remember i am around if you need me i'm i'm here for you he didn't say anything more than that and i think that that kind of stayed with me as a as a statement even today when i when i sometimes feel a little sad or i feel a little let down by the world uh, or by people around me i just think about myself and i said you know what but i'm not alone so uh, that gives me a lot of motivation and courage uh, but at the same time um, i think again life has its own turns and and own ways of rewarding i would not say rewarding i would say more like um, of taking care of its own people and uh, and and my faith and my belief has always been very very strong in the universe and i said you know this is this is fabulous so i pulled myself back and luckily i i thought of restarting my pr business i also started thought of going back into journalism uh, i started calling a few friends and i started calling a few colleagues to figure out if there were opportunities for me to look at uh and one fine day just like uh, just like a magic wand i got a call from from a wonderful lady at star tv and she said i'm doing something uh new and i'd like you to come and join my team and there i was i just landed at the office and and she gave me a fabulous opportunity she introduced me to this world of licensing and consumer products and at first i was like okay i mean it's a new thing let's learn something there's nothing for us to to lose um and yeah it was that day and it's today it's been like almost a good 16 years that i've been part of this industry 